Hi there. Today we're talking about how to talk to those around you about your decision to take a break from alcohol or cut back on your drinking. So many of our Daybreak members find that surprisingly, talking to those around them about their decision to stop drinking is difficult. It may be that drinking to excess was part of their identity and their social life. It might be because they know that those close to them might be disappointed they've decided to make a change and might react negatively or with judgment. Sometimes this fear is justified. People don't like change, but the good news is that if these people care about you and your well-being, they will likely come to understand and accept your changing relationship with alcohol. In some cases, people have reported that their friendships and relationships get even better after cutting back on drinking. With this in mind, we've put together some tips for you to consider when starting that conversation. Number one, choose a good time. Look, midway through a champagne toast at a big celebration is not the best time to tell your friends that you're not drinking. Some people find that it's helpful to let people know ahead of an event so that expectations are set and the host can arrange some alcohol-free options for you. This is also helpful for people to get used to the concept of you not drinking so they don't respond emotionally if you were to tell them in the moment. Number two, explain your decision, but don't ask for permission. It often surprises me that people have such strong opinions about whether someone is drinking or not. If you're a bit lost as to what to say to someone who offers you a drink or asks you why you aren't drinking, some useful phrases are, I'm focusing on my health right now, so taking a break from alcohol, or I realized I feel much better without alcohol, so I'm not drinking tonight. The good thing to remember is that your decision to have a break from alcohol is a really personal one and based on a number of factors. And you don't actually have to explain this to anyone if you don't feel comfortable. Number three, normalize reactions and stay focused on your goals. With Australia's intense drinking culture, we can expect a few less than supportive reactions. One thing that many Daybreak members find is that a person's reaction often speaks to their own relationship with alcohol and your decision to change might trigger an overreaction in them, especially if their own drinking is on the excessive side. If you're finding this and noticing some resistance from those around you, it's best to focus on your own goals and try not to pay too much attention to the reactions of those around you. Well, that's it from me. Thanks for watching and see you next time.